I am installing the front bumper. You have to pull this plastic piece off by prying it off. There's two bolts here and one bolt on the back side, on each side, and unplug the fog lights. I am going to go ahead and cut out my crash bars because you can see them with the bumper and this driver's side one rubs on the tires. I'm just going to sawz on them. You can't get the bolts out because the bolts would hit the body. There are the crash bars. We got primer on them right now. I'll paint them just to keep the exposed. I also took off the front tow hooks. These little plastic things just slide forward and they come off. And that was a 15 millimeter. Take those tow hooks off. Next is the winch plate mounting bracket. The two holes that are closer to each other and where it dips down goes towards the front. Let me show you where that dips down. And then the knees go in with them ears sticking towards the front. I haven't found out what that notch is for. It doesn't really say in the directions. I don't feel nothing in the frame right now. But they just slide right in pretty easy. Let's get this bolted up. I am using the Badlands Apex 12,000 pound winch. I was, I was able to get that up in there with this plate. I just started the bolts with that plate. That way I didn't have to take them all the way back out. But it fit in there. Alright, the winch and the winch plate is bolted up. I did these three bolts at 75. I did these four bolts for the winch at. The hell did I do them at? 40. At 40. And those were a 5 8 bolt. 5 8 socket. Got the winch all wired up. Comes. Let's see if I can get you in there. Down through there, there's some wiring running across the bottom of the radiator up to there. And I put these battery terminals on there. I had to cut this one in the back and put the terminal that comes with it on. And I couldn't get it back up here where I wanted it. So it's just wired to there. I got it from this website right here. That way I have a bunch of other connections. I still got this free. There's two back here that are free. Here's the finished product of the front bumper. There's two bolts up underneath each side. For you to get it 18 millimeter bolts or nuts i should say two 18 millimeter nuts on each side to put on only thing i'm not sure about is i don't know if i'm going to end up cutting that or just power it out probably just end up powering it out each time you can't really get to that handle down in there there is a big hole in the bottom I don't know if I can, I mean, you can get to it. Not fun, but you can get to it. Wouldn't be something you'd want to do in a hole. So I'll probably just power it out. I have to measure what size light bar this is and get one. Oh, it's already dented. Not bad looking. The fog lights do plug right in if you got factory fog lights. That's kind of a bonus. They come with wiring. With the relay and everything, little switch, but I didn't need to use that. 